Kuala Lumpur last weekend saw uber popular K-pop group BTS performing at its first ever fan event and concert in Busan, South Korea. The seven-member music outfits agency, Big Hit Entertainment, had enforced a security check to ensure that the ticket buyer's details matched the ticket holder's identity documents during the event on Saturday. According to Yon Hap, this resulted in a certain number of fans missing the event after they were denied entry even though they had tickets in their possession. Apparently, teenage fans who had purchased the tickets using the names of their parents were turned away. Students who presented copies of their student ID cards were not given entry as well. Big Hit later stated that an announcement detailing the stricter identification checks had been posted on ticket purchasing sites, BTS fan cafe and social media prior to the start of online ticket sales for the concerts in Busan. The stricter-than-usual ruling of the ticket ID matching requirements continued to be enforced on Sunday as well despite further complaints from fans and their parents. Insiders had commented that this was one of the K-pop industry's measures in curtailing the rampant illegal act of ticket scalping in South Korea. The immense popularity of K-pop has made it very competitive for fans to acquire tickets. Adding to the problem are unscrupulous ticket brokers who make bulk purchases of tickets with macro programs and then sell them via social media and online communities for a huge premium. Fans, who are mostly young students, are then forced to resort to the black market where they have no choice but to pay extravagant amounts of money for the tickets. An example given was the concert by the now disbanded music group, 101, in Seoul earlier this year where regular tickets were going for about 100,000 Korean won, around RM355. These tickets were then resold at sky-high prices that started from 1 million Korean won, around RM3547. An unnamed official from the agency said, parents who bought tickets for their children might feel it was unfair. But the agency has already noticed it, and there is no exception. This time, Big Hit's handling will probably create awareness about ticket scalping. BTS is set to stage another round of its muster fan meetings and concerts this weekend. The upcoming events in Seoul will also feature the same stringent ID screening process. Copyright News Straits Times Press, M. B. H. D.